Hi, Wrightsville kids. I'm Pastor Julia. Today in church, we are talking about Jesus. And we're talking about when Jesus was born and then came and lived with us. And I wanted to tell you a story about something that happened really soon after Jesus was born. You might know this story already or even have heard it in the song, We Three Kings of Orient Are. Well, after Jesus was born, several really smart, wise people from a different part of the world, from the East, came and visited the baby Jesus. And that was really surprising because they were seen as really big, special, important people. And they came to visit this little baby who was born to a poor mother and father, and nobody else really seemed to care very much about them. Well, when they came, they brought the baby Jesus three gifts. Do you know what those are? The first gift was gold. And here I have a gold ring with me. We use gold now to make jewelry a lot of times. And back when Jesus was born, gold was even more rare than it is now. The only people who really had gold were kings. So when the wise men gave the baby Jesus gold, it was saying that he was a king, which is kind of funny because he was just a little baby, right? The second gift was something called frankincense. Can you say that? Frankincense. Well, maybe you knew what gold was, but frankincense we don't see as much anymore. I have some frankincense here, which has been turned into incense, which looks like this. And what you do with incense is you burn it and it makes a pretty smell, kind of like a candle. And it used to be, uh, back in Jesus's time, that people would take frankincense, incense, and burn it as a way to honor God. So when they brought the baby Jesus frankincense, they were saying that this little baby is God. Wow, that's even crazier than saying he was a king. Well, the third thing that they brought is called myrrh. Myrrh, that's kind of a funny word. Well, I have a little jar here of myrrh. Um, it smells really good. It's kind of an oil that you can put on yourself like this. It smells really good. And what myrrh was used for was actually to put on someone's body after they had died as a part of burying them and honoring them. Well, that seems like a really weird present for a baby, isn't it? Well, when the wise men were bringing it to Jesus, they were saying that Jesus was going to die and that it was going to be somehow really important. So the wise men brought gold, frankincense, and myrrh to the baby Jesus. And when they did that, they were teaching us something, which is that Jesus is our king, Jesus is our God, and Jesus' death on the cross is really, really important. So now when you sing that song at Christmas, you know what it means. I hope that you can remember all of these things that Jesus means to us. And most importantly, remember that Jesus loves you so, so much. Let's pray. Jesus, we love you so much. We thank you that you love us even more. Thank you that you are our king, that you are our God, and that your death meant something really important for us. We love you, and it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.